Hey guys, how's it going? Billy here. Happy New Year's to you guys. Um, isn't it funny that um, I have like three of these hoodies in three different colors and I'm always like wearing this one when I'm making a video. But um, anyways, I wanted to talk about COVID real quick. Um, you guys, I don't know if I mentioned, I'm pretty sure I did, haven't. Uh, I had COVID back in February and it was um, a horrible experience, you know, there's people over there. It was a really bad experience for me. Um, you know, I don't wanna get it again. And right now COVID is on the rise uh, here in the US, especially New York, where, which is where I live. Um, you know, I've been reading the news, they're saying like New York is pretty bad. Overall um, in the US is pretty bad. Um, I'm not sure how it is in Europe right now or the rest of the world. Um, I don't know if the numbers have increased because of Omicron. I think that's how you say it, the variant Omicron. But um, like a lot of people I know, like family members, friends have gone COVID. So like I'm surrounded by COVID right now. And I've had that shit in February, uh, the first week. And like I said, it was a horrible experience. Um, I, w I had, I, w I tested positive for uh, like 11, 12 days. For four days, it was, I felt like I was fucking dying. It was before the vaccines came out. I, was, uh, I wasn't vaccinated. And uh, like, it was just, it was just bad. And even though I was, I, you know, after two weeks I tested negative, I went back to work. I did not feel the same and I felt like the effects of COVID for at least two or three months, um, especially in my memory. Like, like I would forget things really quick. Like, uh, um, you know, I don't know if that's exactly COVID, what it does to you, but like it fucked me up. So um, in Christmas, like we had a family gathering, you know, like most people do. And I had a, couple of family members who tested positive and then I guess it spread because now like practically everyone except me and my uh close family like my parents and siblings didn't get it um I guess we got lucky but you know the everyone else who was in that Christmas uh gathering uh tested positive and it's just crazy but the only thing is um they they recover pretty quickly like um, they're saying the Omicron uh, variant is not as bad as, you know, the other variants, which uh, is a good thing. And also, I think it's, it might have to do because uh, it has to do because they're vaccinated. So, you know, they were able to beat the uh, COVID in their bodies a lot quicker. So, you know, that's good for them because I was a little worried about them. I'm also worried about me because I don't want to catch it again, even though, you know, who knows, I might catch it again, even um, without wanting to. It just happens, shit is uh, super contagious. But um, yeah, cause I didn't wanna, I definitely didn't wanna get it again. I've been, um, you know, with that, uh, that my mask, like you see here, my fucking car is dirty, but bunch of masks from work. Like at work, I have to wear a mask uh, 24 seven, except when I'm eating but I deal with clients and shit and uh, I have to wear a mask. So, you know, I I, I, I feel all right. And some people are nasty and cough with their mask on or some people don't wear a mask, but you know, I'm wearing a mask there. And so far I haven't gotten sick from, from any clients or anything like that. Like I got sick in February cause my, my younger brother, he's the one who got uh, the COVID first from one of his friends. And then, you know, he spread it through to me, he spread it to my parents. And like I said, it was horrible. But, um, so I wanted to share my experience with COVID. I know, you know, some of you guys are in Europe, some of you guys watching are in the US or maybe some other place. And, you know, try your best to protect yourself. It's a new year, hopefully, Hopefully this will be the year that where, you know, we beat COVID. I mean, 
COVID's gonna stay with us forever, but you know, like keep it down so 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 much that it won't affect our lives anymore. Um, but you know, who knows? Who knows? Um, anyways, I think that's it. I just gotta, you know, I just gotta wait until you know my close friends and family members recover from COVID, and then I'll I'll start feeling okay again. And it's not just them; it's like a lot of other people, like um, a lot of people, my friends, my family know, have heard that uh, that have tested positive. So, you know, it's like, we're literally surrounded by COVID, but I'm pretty sure I'll get out alive because I'm vaccinated and I've already had that shit. I uh, should be getting my booster sometime this month in January, maybe February. Um, I think that's pretty much it. Yeah, I know. I know it's weird. It's a weird topic to talk about, because especially here in the U.S., the vaccines is a little politicized. But you know, it's a uh, it's a topic to talk about. You know. Anyways, I'm excited about the Dragon Ball movie. I haven't been watching anime right now uh, in a while. Um. I told you guys I was watching the what's it called, uh, My Hero Academia. I'm still waiting for the last season to be dubbed on Hulu so I can watch it. Um, and that's pretty much it. Um, I'm still addicted to Dokkan Battle. It's a Dragon Ball phone game. I'm so addicted to that shit. Like it's really really bad. Like I need to. I, I hate my friend for uh, for showing me about that game because you know I, I'm seriously fucking addicted to that game. It's really bad it's a it's a fucking waste of time playing that game but I, I just can't stop anyways um that's it guys take care